Hello there, Insomaniacs! Are you excited? I know I'm excited. My Pokemon are excited because I'm spamming the touch screen like just to annoy you guys. Welcome to more Pokemon Diamond Nuzlocke with Conus Board of Insomania Game. Howdy, how's it going, Sham the Bee? That's what I said to a really impatient boy earlier too. The gym leader is a user of rock type Pokemon. But listen up, rock type Pokemon really hate water, alright? They also weak to grass type moves. Gee, they so have weaknesses. But don't think it'll be easy. You don't get to be a gym leader without covering for weaknesses. Going after a rock type Pokemon or a fire type Pokemon won't be easy either. That's all the advice I can give. Thanks for listening. Oakbrook City Pokemon Gym Leader Rock. Certified trainers Reek, of course. Now you can skip all the trainers if you just take this route. But I actually recommend you to fight them just for experience and all that stuff. Okay, let's see. Not the Pokedex. I meant Pokemon. Let's switch to Jew in front. Okay, I'm pretty certain Tajiu is gonna be the one sweeping this gym. Ha 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 ha. You avoided the long way around. Let's see why you'll do that. Simple, because I know I'm going to beat you, stupid idiot. Why else would I not take the long route? Anyway, youngster Jonathan sends out Geodude! Which I already faced a dozen of them in the mines, and I don't care that this one is still level 10. It's still quad weak to bubble. Ugh, ha 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 ha. Fain in one shot, pretty please. Fain in one shot, there we go, that's what I like to see. Both to fainted? Yeah. Ton of experience points. And now I understand why you decided to battle with me. Yup, to grind experience off you and take your money. You should go whichever way you want, long way or the shortcut. Yeah, yeah, kid. Only those who wanna win can challenge a Pokemon gym. Oh, I wanna win. If I lose, it's all over for the Nuzlocke challenge, quite honestly. Chance by Youngster Darius. Youngster Darius also sent out a Geodude. Obviously didn't learn for the other guy. Oh boy. Geodude, level 8. Bubble. Hit. There we go. Faint, faint, faint. There. I mean, come on. I know it's gonna faint. Why am I even saying that? Geodude fainted, did you gain 124 experience points? Did you go to level 15? Yay! Did you want to learn to move pack? Did you can't learn more than 4 moves? Well duh, of course forget a move. Water spot, it sucks. Ha <laughs> ha Okay, and did you learn pack? Too bad it's not useful for this gym. Yeah, about send out Onyx, keep battling. There he is, send out Onyx. There we go. Bubble! Hit! Faint? Come on, come on, I know you're gonna faint. I know you're gonna faint. There we go, it's super effective too. Huh, <laughs> I didn't take any damage from the trainers in this gym at all. Wow, Rock, you don't pick your apprentice as well. Ugh, this is humiliating! One day I'm gonna become a tough trainer like you. Anyway, the gyms in Sinnoh, they tend to use 3D because they like to show off the 3D-ness. That they, the new engine that they make. <laughs> the game engine that they make. Anyway, it's gym leader time! This is the moment you guys all love. I mean like, whenever you all watch the Pokemon Let's Play, gym leaders are always the episodes with the most views, I think. Anyway, you ready? You ready, Tajiu? Take that as a yes. Welcome! This is the Ogre Pokemon Gym! I'm Rock, the gym leader! But I am but one trainer who decided to walk proudly with Rock-type Pokemon. As the gym leader, I need to see your potential as a trainer. And I'll need to see the toughness of the Pokemon that battle with you. It's boss time! This is the first game to introduce VS sequences for gym leaders, by the way. Anyway, Rock, huh, what do I have to say about him? He's the only gym leader to not have his Pokemon all movesets changed in Pokemon Platinum at all, which... I don't know, it's just kind of weird to me, quite honestly. Anyway, bubble. Like, I'm not gonna be spamming that. <laughs> anyway, rock type gym. What do I have to say? Like, a lot of regions start with rock type gyms. Kanto starts with one. Owen starts with one. Sinnoh starts with one. That's like half of the regions. At least of those that came out right now. Kaleos is the re latest region so far. Then at least they started with Buck that time. Okay, let's see. Little Rock sent out Onyx. Okay, there we go. 
Okay, more bubble. Rock throw. Ouch. That might hurt. Okay, maybe not. Bubble. Hit. Fame. It's super effective. Oh boy. There we go. We're taking him down. We're taking him down. So far, so good. So far, so good. The Jiguru level 16. Oh, by the way, I love this gym theme. It's so atmospheric. I love atmospheric gym themes. Kranidos. Okay, this is his main Pokemon. Okay. This thing, however, is an offensive tank. Quite honestly. Think you can take down the next Pokemon like you did earlier? The full Kranidos has Mole Breaker. By the way, what Rock just did just now, I love that too. That's something they introduced in Gen 4, which is... Boss trainers in the middle of a battle, they can suddenly reappear and taunt you. I'm sad they didn't they, they didn't bring this back for Pokemon X and Y because why? I love that. Anyway, ugh, Kranidos is ridiculously offensive. You want to take this thing down quick, or it's going to sweep your entire team. <laughs> quite literally, it also has Mole Breaker, which, quite honestly, is quite the move. Mole Breaker makes it so that um. Ouch! Oh my goodness! Mole Breaker, as I was about to say before he <laughs> hit me like that. Oh man! <laughs> Makes it so that it negates your ability. Ouch! See what I said? This thing is freaking offensive. You have to have a third wick Piplup or Monferno or you won't beat him. Well, what? That can't be! My buffed up Pokemon! What? The Jiu is evolving! Yay! Okay, the Jiu is growing from a small pen penguin to an even bigger penguin. Oh, and I can't. I mean, a small blue toad to an even bigger blue toad. I mean, a small blue. Oh, whatever. Yo, the Jiu evolved into Print Lap. Why couldn't I have evolved this before? <laughs> oh, never mind. Yes, Metacore is awesome. One, two, and poof! Did you forgot how to use Growl? Too bad you can't Growl anymore. <laughs> and did you learn Metaclaw? Okay, there we go. This is embarrassing. I went to lost to a trainer who didn't have a single gym badge. But that's tough. You were strong and I was weak. That's all there is. According to Pokemon League rules, I have to give you our gym badge since you've beaten me, the leader. Here's your official Pokemon League co badge. There we go! First gym badge get! Woo! Having that cold badge means your Pokemon can now use the hit and move Rock Smash outside of battle. You should also take this too. Obtain the TM76! That TM76 contains the move Stealth Rock! Small gone high! I mean seriously, in competitive battle, you will see people spamming spikes and stealth rocks a lot. It's a move that inflicts damage on foes that switch into battle. Incidentally, a TM will teach a move to a Pokemon instantly. But a TM will break when you use it, so make certain you want a Pokemon to learn that move. In this region of Sinnoh, there are seven other gym leaders. I should warn you, they're a lot tougher than I am. Yes, they are. Although the gym leaders in Platinum are a lot tougher than the ones in Diamond and Pearl, they're still a lot tougher than he is. And even in Platinum, he didn't even get any changes to his moveset. Ugh, you suck. Oh, Konis, you've taken care of the gym leader. Oh, did my advice come in handy or what? If my advice was useful, it'll be great if you become my fan. How about you become my fan? Subscribe to Instamania Game and my channel for anti-boredom wonderfulness. Okay, anyway, enough joking. If you enjoyed this episode of Let's Play Pokemon Diamond Nuzlocke, do feel free to leave a like or be an anti-boredom fighter and subscribe. That was actually quite a close finish, I have to admit. It was quite the close finish. Eh, uh -huh. we hope to see you again. Okay, Jim. By the way, you can polish the badge by wiping on it. Polish hype. Yay. Okay, see you guys next time. Saving, don't turn off the power. And next time, we'll, uh, I don't know, head back to Jubilife City.